Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It is me, Chris James, and I am back for yet another video. So, for today's video, I have been asked multiple times, do you wear makeup while filming? The answer to that question is yes, I do. I'm not wearing any right now because that's the whole purpose of this video, is for me to show you guys how I get ready to do my YouTube videos. So let's just start with this video and we will see where she goes, because Lore, I don't even know. All right, so the first step in any buddy's makeup is a good face cream. So this is what I use, Bulldog Skin Care for Men Original Moisturizer. Got some green tea. Girl, it's got some shit in it, that's good. So we're just gonna apply about that much to your finger and then just rub it all over your face and turn. So there's that step down. Face is all hydrated. So I like to use Nude by Nature. It is a face primer, a perfecting primer. It's a really nice face primer. I love to use this. This is, and it's the smell. I like smells and this, the Bulldog, it smells, oops, it smells like, like, uh, like lemongrass almost, and it, it just it smells really pretty. I got sparkles all over the place. My makeup box down there, my little bin with my makeup in it, it's filled with sparkles and glitter. Oh my god. So stuff gets everywhere. Again, just put a little bit on your finger and then apply it to where you want to really perfect. And that would be that area for me. We are ready to begin the makeup portion of this video. I need to get my hair cut so badly. Oh my gosh. We have the moisturizer on, we have the priming primer on. The priming primer. I'm not sure about this foundation. This was given to me and I just, I like it because it's like a cream foundation, whereas the other one that I have, the the full coverage, it's more of like a, like a, like a paste, because it's like thick. But this one here is very like, liquidy, and I like it. The look that I'm going for right now can really be achieved with any type of makeup, I want to say. Like, you don't have to use this foundation if you don't like this foundation, or if you can't get this foundation. It's not a big deal. You get whatever foundation looks good on your skin. And I only use a very little amount. I don't use too much. I, I just apply it to where uh, I feel like it looks the best. I'm just gonna quickly put a little bit of um, my Total coverage, L'Oreal Paris, 24 hours. And I also, because I have a beard, uh, I tend to just go in the spots that are pretty thin, because my skin tone underneath is like a pinky color, and the makeup is obviously more of like a, a tanned color. So I tend to go in there and just do that. Just rub it around, and then I use the the clean spot on my thing and I just brush it down so that the makeup goes off the front of my beard and it just shows it underneath. To me that works for me. So this is with the foundation. I think it looks pretty good. That's just the foundation. I don't really have any rhyme or reason to 
what I put on first. I usually just put it all on, and then if I need to add more, I do. I don't know if that's the proper way. Like I said, there's no real rules to putting on makeup. You just put it on to what you want to accomplish with your makeup. So next we are going to go in with the blush because I do like to add a little bit of rosiness to my cheeks. I like to use Maybelline New York Fit Me Blush in shade 30. It is the only blush I really use. It has got me through a lot of drag makeups. Okay, so we're going to add a small amount of blush to begin with. Right there is where I like to add my blush. I feel like just a little bit of pink in the cheeks is really cute. Okay, we're going with brown dry, just to cover up some of it anyways. And just blow my nose. Next, we go with the bronzer. I like to go in with J. Manuel Beauty. It is a bronzer. It is a nice dark tan color and it has a little tiny bit of a shimmer. It's really cute. Alright, let's go in with some bronzer. There was a lot on the brush, let me tell you. So here we are, just like that. And I like to go in with Makeup Revolution London Bronzer Reloaded in shade Holiday Romance. It's a little bit of a lighter color and it gives it more of like a, a little bit of a shine. I feel like this is like a bronzer mixed with like a light highlighter. So let's just go in with that, shall we? What do y'all think so far? My eyelashes tend to grow really straight. It's the only straight part about me. And I hate when they grow straight because they go straight down and I like to curl, so I have to curl them. I don't use mascara because mascara weighs them down. So when I lift them up and I put mascara on, it just, they flatten out again. It's annoying. But anyways, let me curl my lashes and I will be right back. All right guys, I'm back and my eyelashes are lifted to the heavens, darling. They look pretty. <laughs> they look pretty, they look pretty. <laughs> okay. I have a little trick because like I had mentioned before, I don't use mascara because mascara weighs down my eyelashes. I use NYX Professional Makeup, that's the point. Eyeliner. Let's zoom in so y'all can see what I'm speaking about. Okay. Let's just go like this. Yeah, already I'm watching my eyelashes like grow almost. And then that happens where I accidentally touch my skin, the marker, and it comes off. You know what? It's not even that bad. It's not even that bad. It's not even that bad. That's the only problem with using this, is you gotta be thinking. Super careful. I know I said this is a boy look, but it is a boy look. It's a pretty boy, pretty boy look. So I do the tops. And then I also do the bottoms. The bottoms you'll notice more. Let me just do the bottoms real quick and I'll be right back. Can you tell? I think you can tell the difference. All right guys, this is the final look. This is what I usually have on my face in my YouTube videos. We have reached the end of the video. Thank you so much for coming and hanging out with me. I totally love hanging out with you guys. If you enjoyed, please like, comment down below. And if you have not already subscribed, please 
do me a favor and just click the little subscribe button. Oh, and if you're really feeling it, click the little bell icon so you can be updated when I upload a brand new video. Till next time, guys. It's always a pleasure. All right, I'll see you guys soon. Bye, guys. Bye, guys.